All right, everyone, welcome back. Today, we are on our next installment of our 13-week Queen of the Murder Scene journey, and today, we are on Red Hands Never Fade. Now, before I get into any of my synopsis stuff or into the lyrics or watching this or whatever, um, when I saw this title, when we did our um, reaction last week, uh, you know, I was looking at it saying, Red Hands Never Fade. So, in my own opinion, of course, there was some, you know, uh, what's the word for it? Can't I couldn't, word. I, I simply couldn't tell. It wasn't definitive for me. There we go. It wasn't definitive. For me. For you. But for me, reading this next song, that's what I was trying to get at. Uh, but for me, reading Red Hands Never Fade insinuated to me, before I even looked at it, or the lyrics or anything. Well, I didn't know, um, I didn't yeah. know about Red it, Hands Never Fade. Yeah. To me, just in that title, it says, I now have blood on my hands and it's never going to go away. But you knew that. But that's just what I'm getting off of the title. I haven't even read the synopsis on it. No, I, I understand that. But the title would kind of say exactly what the right. thought process was. Right. It insinuates that they have blood on their hands and it's never going to go away. Right. So, Which to you would kind of give you the idea, if that's the next installment, that... That, is, that, that it was it, definitive. That it was that definitive she, that, that it happened. That it and happened. now we are going to be seeing the after effects and the side effects but, from it. But since I didn't know that, right. that's where I was, as I was looking at the lyrics last week. Right. You know, right. could it be this? Could it be she was about to do it? Or had she actually done it yet? You weren't too be sure on that. Because it could have. Because to be honest with you, depending on how you read, how mm -hmm. you, uh, how you would read those lyrics, even, even with right at the very end, where, and you it, are it, mine, and and you are mine, okay. That's where all it, of the fans insinuated that it happened, where the band had indicated that it happened. I was at the you are mine, but it doesn't necessarily have to have been done so anyway but, but yeah now knowing let this, me read the synopsis here. now knowing this title yeah let that, me read the synopsis here. that makes it a little more definitive. it says in red hands never fade the queens or the, i'm sorry the queen turns remorseful here she's asking her love to forgive her about her mistake killing him of course it cannot be undone her hands are bloody and that cannot be righted. So exactly what well, I was getting I at right before the title, or right as I was saying in the title, Red Hands Never Fade. Well, I guess that makes it a little more definitive then, yeah, doesn't right? it? Right? If you yeah. weren't too sure then, you are sure, sure now. I'm sure, I'm sure now. Exactly. So anyway, do you just want to get into this? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Let's get these on. Yeah, let's let's get in here. Let's Let's see what the queen has to tell me this week. Okay. Let me know when you are ready. Go for it. All right. And play. Tell me what I must do to return for what I did to you, so Tell me to step over fire. What is your desire? Cause it is done. One more than it'll be done. The game you already won.
to me. Raises a couple of questions for me, and these are very obvious questions, kind of based off of the synopsis, um, because there really wasn't a lot to decipher apart from what had already been said in the synopsis, right. where it's more of remorse, it's of how can I make this right, uh, and what I put down is literally saying, it can't be undone, will, what will you do? And then a second one was, how will you live with what you've done? And I, and I guess that's what we will figure out in the next couple of songs, but for me there really right. wasn't a lot of uh, digging in that needed to be done. It was pretty clear cut. You know, on some of these synopsises, um, it said, or you know, it might leave you on a cliffhanger, or it might not define something very well, and you have to make your own conclusion to it. But on this, I think to me, it was very, very clear. And I only had those two questions at the end. What will you do now, now that this cannot be undone? I agree. Because I was look, I was, I was trying to figure out the same thing as far as okay, wait a minute, as I'm reading, as I'm reading the lyrics, mm -hmm. and I'm listening, and I, you know, I'm listening to it, and I'm, you know, looking at the synopsis and everything, and, and I'm like, what is there? Right. You know, as far as digging in, as far as digging into the, you know, as far as digging into the lyrics are concerned, because, you know, I killed the guy. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do anything about it now. Right. <laughs> you know, and, you know, as far as there just wasn't there really wasn't there really less, isn't right. anything else. You know, something that I did that I, notice yeah. was that there was it was really really rocky. It was really hard. It was really you know in your face. And that's what I've been told is that there's going to be more of that as this is a rock novel, as I've been told to say it. Uh, but I feel there was more rock in this one than there was in others, and I can attribute that to her being conflicted mm. about what do I do now, now that I've done this, uh, you've got, you know, of course, the red hands never fade, you can't undo it, but where do you go from here? And she's uh, conflicted, she's angry, you know, it's, mm, what did I just do? Do I really have what I want? And that's what I said at the, uh, at the end of uh, the last one that we did, where I said, did you really get what you want? There's a couple of things in here that you just found. That I just found. <laughs> okay. Okay. Is I'm, you know, is I'm looking at this though. Um, one of them. W one of them is when we take another step closer to our demise. Mm -hmm. Okay. I mean, we know what his demise <laughs> was. Right. Okay. Where is this leading? Maybe this is a foreshadowing. Where is this leading her? Right. That might be a foreshadowing What's her... line. When we're leading ourselves to our demise. Yeah, where is she? I think that's a foreshadowing line. Where, yeah, where is she headed in all of this? That's a head, that's a head scratcher for me. Okay. Okay. Because, you know, I mean, her, what she was after is gone. Mm hmm Because she killed him. Right. <laughs> I mean, you know, there he is, you know, either tied to a chair, you know, you know, or laying on the floor or whatever it is, you know. Mm -hmm. But he's no longer. Right. You, you know. Um, you know, so where does that, so where does that leave her? Mm hmm Where is, <laughs> you know, where, right. where, where, where is she going at this point? Okay, so what? So what is her demise, and is and is that what we are going to mm -hmm. figure? You know, find out where you know where she's leading, or where we're going with her. Y you know, the other thing is, tell me, when did you get to decide? But right there, I think that she's. You know, when did you get to decide? But that's her psychologically trying to process it. Well, because is he cause with, is he deciding? Well, that's psychological. Is, that's psychological because she decided his fate, which ultimately decided hers. hers. Right. So that's her thinking about it. That's the psychology. That's pretty it. deep. That's actually pretty deep mm -hmm. <laughs> when you think about mm -hmm. it. She Is signed it, his death certificate, but in return, he's probably just signed hers. That's that's pretty. 
That's a pretty deep. That's a pretty deep lyric when you think about it. Like when I said, I think it was in Stalker, when um, when I was talking about the say uh, the psychosis and the um, psychology behind all of this. It's interesting to see the turn in how she thinks, and that's what we're experiencing now. Going from here to all I want is you to well now I've just killed you and now I've murdered you and now I have to figure out where I'm going and the, where the mind is taking you because ultimately this feels like a mind journey for me. You know, the, there's one other line in here where she where it says the game you already won. Okay, he's out of the game at this point. Okay, so as far as he's concerned. You know, he's a, she's the only one left in this game. You know. What's she going to do? She, you know, so now we got to see how she, how she deals with. Yeah. How she deals with I think this. that's the overlying question here is how is she going to deal with it? What's Yikes. She, what's she, she going to do? Yikes. So, uh, you know, this is, this is getting kind of. Spooky. We should have done. I'll tell you. We should. We should have done this for uh, for Halloween. Halloween. Man, this is this is getting. This is just getting deep. This is just getting. This is just getting deep. Yeah. But um. All right. Yeah. Let's see what um. Uh, let's see where um. Her demise. Takes us. All right. I'm re I'm ready. Okay. Uh, do I have my notes, my note sheet anywhere? Do I you have your note sheet? I don't think I do for my announcements. Uh, so I'm going well, to go me. off of the, um, the little notes that I just wrote down here. Okay. Uh, if you'd like to send us, if you'd like to send us anything, remember we have our PO box. That information just came up on your screen. Remember to always, uh, you can always come down to Discord. That link is in the description below. It's super fun, super cool. Uh, if we get enough warning fans on there, we might put a little warning tab there, so that's all we can discuss in that one little tab. Remember, we do have our Patreon down in the description as well if you'd like to help support us on there. Uh, but if you would like to help support us, but you would not like to be on Patreon, we do have a PayPal donation link down below as well. Uh, and last but not least, we have our subscriber goal of 10,000 subs by the end of the year, guys. Um, we're kind of like right in the middle of December right now, so we don't have that much time left. Uh, so for all of you who are not yet subscribed, we highly encourage you all to do so, so that not only can you help us with this goal, but you don't miss out on the cool videos coming from the channel, the live streams every Friday night, uh, and anything else we have coming from this channel. Uh, 2021 is going to be exciting uh, to see where the channel ends up. Absolutely. So uh, anyway, you have anything else? They'd like to add? No, I'm hey, I'm good. You just want to get on next week. I just want to I just want to get on next week. Too. Okay. Alrighty guys, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to smack that like button, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you all next week. Peace out.